I want to connect Google Sheets and MailChimp so that when a new row is added with a lead or contact, they're added as a subscriber in one of my MailChimp lists. But there's no direct integration, and I don't want to spend all my time copying and pasting. With Zapier, I can connect MailChimp to Google Sheets so that new rows create new subscribers. If you don't know Zapier, it's an automation tool that makes connecting all your apps happen in a matter of clicks. And Zapier is going to help me create subscribers in MailChimp from new rows in Google Sheets with a Zap, an automated workflow. All I'll need to do is connect my MailChimp and Google Sheets accounts. First things first, I'll connect my Google Sheets account. We have links to our privacy and data policies in the description, but basically, we keep your account information secure with bank level encryption. We don't take chances with your data. My Google Sheets account is connected and tested, so now we have to select the spreadsheet and worksheet for this app to monitor. This down caret button means I have to select from a list, so let's find the right ones. Now let's grab a sample row to use and we can get to connecting MailChimp. This gives Zapier permission to add a subscriber in MailChimp. We have another down caret button to select a specific audience to add this subscriber to. And when you see this button, that means you can grab information from the first step to populate this field. I'll do that for the email address. Now, when I click test, we're actually going to add the subscriber in MailChimp, so keep that in mind when you test your Zaps too. Zapier is actually making the action happen. It's a success, so let's check out MailChimp. And there it is. Just like that, we connected Google Sheets to MailChimp. Now, every time I add a row in Google Sheets, Zapier will add them as a subscriber in MailChimp. To set this app up, I used a Zap template. They make it faster to create a workflow and come with the apps and actions all ready to go. If you clicked on Make a Zap or your editor looks a little different, don't worry, the principles are all the same. For more information on Zapier, this Zap template and more resources, check out the description. We hope this helps you be more productive.